Greetings everyone. It's nearly October and um, possibly by the time I get this video up it will be October and that means it's time to switch up my decks again. Now I'm not particularly keen to actually change my decks. It's if you've seen my video from last month I um, was very excited as I said a number of times to be using my sort of Russian troika. Uh, but it's October, guys. Um, that's a special month for me because Halloween. You know, I'm not. I'm not pagan in the sense of you know following the wheel of the year and Samhain and all of this stuff. But but there is something about this time of year, Halloween, uh, All Hallows Eve, All Saints Day, all that sort of thing that really. Hello, by the way, I'm here. Uh, that you just. You can feel it. I can feel it. So whatever my, you know, belief system may or may not be, it is still a special time for me. So I needed to do some other sort of work this month. Um, what I will still be using, what I will continue to use, is look how diddy these are. Aren't they adorable? This is my um, Patience card. This is the Kiev Sorceress. That's a little packet thing it comes in. Um, and I hold that together when I'm not using it. I hold that together with one of those elasticated hairbands, a black one for, to keep in, in color theme. But uh, but I'm I'm really enjoying using these, and I've gotten into the habit of doing what I refer to now as Sunday cards. So that's looking at the week ahead using these cards to see what comes up. And um, I have to say, it's been quite accurate. Um, in hindsight, it's, well, it's always in hindsight, isn't it? So I'm looking forward. I will continue using these on a Sunday. So they're not going away. I love them. Um, but I need to do something. Hi, just want to be hello. You know, so you've got something to look at besides the queen and her attendant and a candle. Um, I've decided I'm finally... Oh, what have I got on my nail? <laughs> I'm finally going to use my... Wild Guan Yin Oracle. I've had this for almost a year. Um, for reasons I do not understand, I connect this deck with my mother for some reason. And, oh God, me, me and my mother issues. But there you go. And I think that's probably why I haven't used it yet. Because that's been a bit, mm, bit fraught. But I think now is the time to dig it out. I've had good progress with the um, Sibylla cards. And you know, if you're not following me, you don't know what the heck I'm talking about. And if you are, you do. So we'll just leave it at that. Um, and I think now is the time to really get stuck into this deck and and see what I come up with. Um, yeah, it's, it's in the air. Spirit work is in the air. White Mantra Mother Protects. It's just saving. Maybe it's because she's a Taurus. You know, and all of these, um, you know, guys are just sort of, just make me think of her. I don't know, but there's just, it's all very female-centric, as you can see, all of the, all of the things. Play with me. Isn't that lovely? Hang on, I'll be a bit careful that you can actually see what I'm doing here. Oh, you've got my shadow. Hi. Um, but there you go. They are beautiful, beautiful cards, but I've hardly worked with them. I, I find it a bit too powerful. So I think October is a good month for powerful cards. So we're going to go with that. Have you seen the backs of them? Aren't they gorgeous? Look at that. Isn't that lovely? Yeah, there we go. There we go. You can see it a bit better. So that's one of the decks I'll be using. That's my, well, that's my oracle. I've kind of gone ass about face, as they say. The tarot I'm going to be using is another deck I've had for ages and haven't used. Um, and I want... I want to work with it, and now seems like a good time. And that is the Vision Quest Tarot. Again, something that I felt very strongly about. I had to have this deck, and then I just didn't use it. I couldn't find the time to use it, and I think I think October is a good time to use that. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And as you can see, I'm pretty sure they are, yeah, still in order. I haven't... Um, I'm sorry, I'm working around my camera again, so sorry, apologize in advance for dodgy camera angles. Well, they might as well get out of order now. Oh, look at that. I like that. So, yeah, this is another area that has meaning for me. Um, growing up where I did, um, 
and yeah, I, I've, I've been wanting and wanting and wanting to work with these cards and just haven't done it. They've sat right next to me. I mean, at you know, I could have turned my hand about six inches and picked them up, but I haven't used them. So I think now is the time. Oh, there's a good one for this time of year. Pumpkins and all sorts. Very nice. Uh, yeah. So I'm looking forward to that. I, I'm, I am really looking forward to this month. I think it's going to be a lot more introspective um, than normal. I, the, the, the rubbish, I'll call it. The rubbish I post on Instagram. You know, sometimes it's meaningful. Sometimes it's just me having a bit of fun, you know, making use of the cards I have. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Um, yes, I'm looking forward to that. Look, I'm just kind of going off into reverie. Ah, la, 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 la. Right, so that's my tarot. That's my oracle. And my other, my other deck for October um, isn't a deck. Because <laughs> I've suddenly had a really strong urge to work with my runes. Yeah. Isn't that this, you know, cute? Came in this little bag. Isn't that sweet with little, little color coordinated ribbons. I love these. These are what she calls sea slate, which is, is basically just um, shards of, of slate that have been worn smooth in the sea. And she collects them and then she paints the, uh, the symbols on them. I don't know if you can see it. I can never get this thing to focus very well. But you see the little... Oh, well, you can see it much easier on the lighter ones. The little row of dots around the edge. I love that. It just sort of sets it off. And then this orange color. I saw these. I actually bought these on eBay. And I will put the details to um, this woman's sort of... I think there's a website. Um, and what have you. I think she's called Sea Witch. Seems a reasonable name. Um, and yeah. So that's my... That's my other... For October. I love these. I just love working with them and I haven't done it for ages and now is the time. I have been contemplating, I am really out of shot here, there we go, yeah, very wonky, um, how I'm going to proceed with this. Um, I'm, I like the idea, it's been good, it's been good to sort of limit myself to you know three decks per month but I don't know. I don't know if it's quite achieving what I hoped it would achieve. Um, I'll have to look at that. And I will probably continue to do it in, into November. Um, December, all bets are off because I just basically shut down and hide for the month of December. Um, I just can't be doing with December. It drives me round the bend. So I probably won't be doing anything. You know, I'll come out of hibernation sort of the end of December, beginning of January. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have to review how I'm doing this and whether I want to sort of say, right, that's it, month's over, stop with these decks, use other decks. Although I did use one of my tarots for two months, but then I was, you know, I sort of obliged myself to use it for a full two months. Maybe I just need to kind of say, right, I only use one tarot, one oracle, one other, but I will use them until such time as I want to use something else, but I, you know, but I have to give myself a decent amount of time. I can't just go, right, I've used that today, now I'm using another one. That's, that's a bit naughty. Don't want to do that. But we'll see how it goes. I mean, it's not that big a deal. Yeah, in the grand scheme of things, it is of little import. But, uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to getting a bit more down and, and dirty with my, <laughs> with my divination this month. Um, that's it really. Haven't got a great deal to say. Lots of stuff to do. It's the weekend and there's always lots of stuff to do at the weekend. I hope you're having a lovely time, wherever you're doing. I hope you're having a relaxing weekend. Um, and I hope to see you. You probably won't see a lot of me here. Um, you might see me on Instagram. Um, I'm hoping actually to put a bit more stuff up on my blog. That's another thing that I've been thinking. I, I have been neglecting. I've been totally avoiding Facebook. Um, yeah, so sorry to, you know, people who might, you know, see me once in a while on Facebook and wonder where I've gone. I just, I just can't even, you know, <laughs> so it just sucks up so much of my time. I don't do anything at all. So not a good thing. Anyway, that's it. I'm going to go.
get on with my work. I think I've got some washing in the tumble dryer that needs putting away. Yay! Oh, the life of a, of a witch and card reader. So exciting. <laughs> I'll see you all later. Take care. Bye.